Syracuse versus Virginia. It's an annual March matchup that ignites the college lacrosse season. It's two programs that play the game without brake pedals, and they're on a crash course tonight in snowy upstate New York. Can Dom Starzia's Cavaliers capture their fifth victory of the campaign? Or will the 10-time national champion Orange win this battle in the latest installment of the Orange and Blue Game of Thrones? We just want to rise up and play our best of cross. That's all we're asking. Nobody has to do it by themselves. Nobody has to do more than we talk about doing every single day. Just get this done. One, two, three. Two. Here we go. Parks versus Daddio. Virginia versus Syracuse. And we are underway in a violation on Daddio to start. And now left wing for Matt White. White, skip pass. The far sideline for Cockerton. Drives hard. Back down his defender. A low to high rip. And he shoots in the silencer from 10 yards away. Cavaliers lead 1-0. Cavaliers leading one to nothing. Extra man advantage here. Out front, Emery lock and load, buries it. Two nothing, Virginia. Hill giving him a full pat down, and Cometti beats him down the pipe, fires, and scores on the bounce shot. Bounce it right in front of Dan Marino, and it finds the upper left corner to bring Syracuse back within one to the left side. Shootmaker spinning 10 yards from the gate. Overhand, powerful shot, and he buries it upper right corner. Tie game. Britain and Syracuse in the end zone. O'Reilly up the left pipe, feeding out the street. Lock and load, and a stick save made by Wardwell of Syracuse with a hard dodge down the right iron. He's got space, stepping inside. Fires and scores. Syracuse has the lead. Three straight goals from the orange. Rice, 160 pounds, rolls against Virginia's Harbison. Feeds out front, left wing shot, score. Derek Maltz cans it from 10 yards out. Owen Van Arsdale, angle to the left of the cage. Try to feed on top ball, loose picked up by Mark Cockerton, and he sticks in his second goal. Cockerton picks up the garbage and puts it in the trash can. UVA back within one. Circle it out front to Marasco, a hard dodge down the right iron, beats his defender right on top of the cage, and he cranks it off the iron again. Virginia there to pick up the rebound. Jojo Marasco, the All-American dodging down the left side against Scott McWilliams. Marasco puts his head into McWilliams and now backs out, head of the square, rolls against McWilliams, angle to the left, wanting a penalty, not gonna get it though, as Marasco forced to go behind the goal against McWilliams. Now slides to his right, spins to his left. Marasco still at X, McWilliams with him every step of the way. Marasco turns, can't get the shot off, now rolls towards the cage, gets inside, and the trail check delivered by Scott McWilliams, knocks the ball free, and he wins that epic matchup. Passed it, GLE left to Nick O'Reilly. Now out front, it is Rob Emery firing and scoring to tie the game. Rob Emery, the Cali Cannon, knocked this one at four. And the violation goes against Syracuse on the faceoff. The officials point in the wrong direction. UVA with a six on five, left wing shot, score! But a timeout taken. Well, he took the timeout just a second before James Pinnell launched the ball into the goal. Front to Ryan Tucker, a split dodge, gets in, fires low and scores! Virginia takes the lead back, and it's Ryan Tucker, the sophomore, to make it 5-4 Wahoos. The ball right wing for Marasco, stepping forward, steps into a shot, and Marino makes the stick save. With Brandon Mullins, a sophomore from Texas, White, a pick and pop with Van Arsdale. Up the right iron, Van Arsdale with seven seconds, turns topside, low shot, and he scores! Owen Van Arsdale gives Virginia a two-goal lead. They milk the clock down to four seconds in the half, and UVA will go into the break leading 6-4. I think I'd give it up. Cross midfield here. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Just as I said, I think I'd give it up. Okay, dumps on top. Wide open shot score. Dylan Donahue slams it upper shelf. Syracuse leads 7-6. Now Streep at the front of the square, running through a check from a long stick defender. Streep getting inside, firing and scoring! A goal for Virginia, and they certainly need it. Charlie Streep, the solo strike in Virginia within one. Now the Wahoos with the ball on the left wing, and it's Matt White firing and scoring to tie the game. Slip down the left iron and knock this contest at eight. Launches the ball downfield. Man wide open on top of the cage. And a point blank save made by Wardwell on Conkerton. I think we just could have, you know, created a little bit more offensively uh, and taken advantage of some opportunities I think we did create. I think we just didn't finish. And, uh, you know, I'm, I'm not surprised. I mean, Syracuse is a very good defensive team. Certainly the most 
athletic team that we've played. By Syracuse's Matt Harris, and then he has the ball knocked out of his stick, throws it back towards the goal. His goalkeeper is out, and then the quick stick shot goes over the crossbar, and it is backed up by a diving Wardwell, the goalkeeper. Now out front to Morasco. Morasco driving hard with three seconds, tries to feed the crease, and it is intercepted by Harry Priebus. Hello, overtime. Next goal wins, into overtime we go. A clamp at the midfield stripe, and Daddio had it for a second, lost the ball. Loose ball on the ground, still a fight for it, and Mick Parks vacuums it up for UVA. Mick Parks, relatively new face-off guy for us, and uh, so every game is a little bit of an adventure. Uh, he's been good. I was fairly confident we were going to win the faceoff in the overtime and, and get the first possession, which is how it played out. Turning topside, White turns, fires low, and a stick save made by Wardwell. 65 seconds, Donahue to Rice, left wing, opens for the win, and he buries it. Donahue to Rice, and they win it 9-8.